Uh, welcome to our YouTube channel. This, uh, I'm Steve Anderson, uh, head engineer here at Merrill Manufacturing Company. We're on the plant today and we're going to talk about the differences between a low price import hydrant, for a yard hydrant from China versus the Merrill C1000. First of all, you'll notice that on the head, they have a weak point right here because it's the rib, supporting rib for the part of the hydrant is so thin that it's uh, considerably easier to break. Uh, one of the other things that you'll notice is the operating stem. The operating stem is brass, which is a real soft material. Soft material, so when you operate it up and down, the brass rubbing against the brass, you'll wear out the brass, and then the brass, well, the, the water can leak up and leak out to the, the stem on the seal. The other thing is they just use O-rings in here for a seal around the rod, which are not very good for long-term use or for repetitive on and on on and off you'll wear out the o-rings fairly quickly the difference is on the head first of all you've got this heavy rib you don't have the weak point like the import hydrant does and also the other thing is i'll get into the other component parts on the top which are actually very important rather than doing it just for price let's do it for quality quality first of all we're, we're using a stainless steel stem not a, a soft brass stem stainless steel was actually much harder material take more wear won't uh, won't cut out and start to leak. Instead of using O-rings, we have a molded packing. The packing is compressed with a packing nut such that it compresses the, the, to make a seal around the rod. 